What is up everyone? I got another tech video here to share with all of you on how you can download your iCloud photos and videos that you might have taken or recorded on your iPhone or Apple device in the high efficiency format, like the HEIF or HEIC or HEVC format. I'm going to show you guys another option for downloading them in the most compatible format, which is the JPEG or MP4 file format. There's two options available to you in iCloud photos to download these photos and videos. I'm running a Windows 11 computer. I'm logged into Google Chrome and I am logged directly into my iCloud photos. I have a video file here, a video file there. The pictures are of course are in HEIC and these are HEVC. So I'm going to highlight this. We'll start with this video. I'm going to highlight this video and let me back out and go back up to that little cloud now. There's something special about this little cloud. Okay and let me move this thing right out where you guys can see it in the middle. This little cloud, if you go over it and click download, it, it's going to download that file to your PC or to to your computer but if you look to the lower right there is another little arrow here and if you hover over it a little text pops up and says more download options before you actually click download if you click this you get another pop-up box here let me explain the two differences the unmodified original version is going to be whatever you had your phone or device set to to record the videos or take the pictures in mine happen to be high efficiency so it's the HEVC or HEIF HEIC whatever uh, H.265 for this one if I choose the most compatible one, if I select that, that's going to be your H.264, your JPEG, your MP4 uh, video file, and that's going to be most compatible. This is actually easier than converting because you can download them directly, and I'm about to show you that. And we're just going to download that video file right now. On my lower left, I don't know if you can see it, it says .mov, and we're going to go in there. You can see the file extension. I'm going to go into my new folder here and just show you guys that I just downloaded that, and it is in the original format, which is the high efficiency, the .mov. So I'm going to go back now and I'm just going to jump up here and do that little arrow thing and go down and select most compatible. So I went from unmodified original, I'm selecting most compatible and I'm going to click download again. Now you'll notice it says .mp4. It's downloading an mp4. We're going to go back in there and look at the two file extensions. This thing in the middle is my recording. Don't that this thingy here doesn't apply. It's this video over here .mov and .mp4. These are both the ones I just downloaded and you can see this is the H.264 format, the most compatible format and this is the high efficiency one. So you have we didn't have to convert and we can also do that with the photos. I'm going to show you with the photos. I'm going to select, I'll uh, select this photo first. When you go in here and if you're using this little feature, make sure you click it a couple times just so it knows, unmodified original. I'm going to click download. You'll notice down there, HEIC, high efficiency. So let's go into the new folder and take a look at this. So there it is in HEIC now, that photo. I'm going to go up here and I'm going to choose most compatible. I'm going to back out, click download. And if we look down here, you can see it says .jpeg. So it is working like it's intended to work. And now you'll see I have both of those files and I didn't convert anything. I have the HEIC version and the JPEG version. So this is an option that you guys have available to you in iCloud Photos to download those videos and photos in those different formats if you just know that little thing is there. So I'm hoping that helps some of you out. And I just want to share something with you guys. There are file extensions here that you might not be seeing on yours. I actually choose to have this show like the .mov, the .jpeg. How I do that is I go into this folder, basically folder options, it's these like three little dots here, and you can come down and select options. And then when you're in your folder options, um, in the center here, it says view, you can choose a view, and you can come down here and uncheck hide extensions for known file types. So if I click apply, you'll see they'll, they disappear. We can no longer see what this is just by looking at it. So I uncheck that and click apply. It's easier for me to know what I'm working with and with my files here. Um, if yours is not showing, you can always go to, uh, you can right click on the picture and go to properties and you should be able to see the type of file from within there if you're not able to see it at the end of the extension. So you can go in here and take a look at those files as well. So if I right click on the HEIC and go to properties, you can see it's an HEIC file. So that's another way if you're not seeing the extension that you can see what type of file that you're working with there. That's basically all I had for you. Thanks a lot guys for watching and I hope this helps. I will see you guys in the next video. Have a good one.